The twelfth instruction is your answer should be complete, but you should not volunteer uh, information or legal theories uh, that are not pertinent to the problem. So, um, I, I was I had a smile on my face there because um, there's a there's a statement in the in the army never volunteer. Well, this is very very similar to that. If you raise legal theories that aren't needed to solve the problem that the facts gave you, what's the grader going to do? They're going to say, what? Why are they raising product liability? It's got nothing to do with this essay. Okay. Or picture this. You're a homeowner and the plumber comes to your house and he says, oh yeah, you got a leak in your sink here. I'll, I'll fix that up in a minute. Here's my tool case. And he opens it up, and then it has one layer of tools, and then it has a second layer of tools, so that he's now displayed about 500 tools. He hasn't even looked under your sink yet, right? And you are going, how much is this going to cost? Okay? He's raising, he's pulling out, he's opening up tools that he doesn't even know yet whether he's going to need. Okay? That's why you can't memorize a template or a checklist in advance of the essay question. What I say in my course is let the facts tell you what the problems are. It's going to tell you what needs to be resolved. So you have to respond to the facts in the question. You do that through making the fact issue chart that I was telling you about earlier. Okay? And then only raise the issue that um, the, the issue and the rule that resolve that factual problem.